die away in the most soft and musical manner that the shepherds had ever heard. Then it would begin again, high up in the heavens, in the very vault of the sky, and descend in sweet and melodious strains. The light would seem to burst forth high up in the heavens, and descend in softer rays, and light up the hills and valleys, making everything more clear than the light of the sun, although not as bright. The shepherds went towards the city in search of whatever the angels were singing about. As they entered the city, Melker, the local priest, came running up, all excited. Melker was not like the other priests in Jerusalem. <laughs> Melker had studied the scriptures. He knew from the book of Daniel that the seed of woman, the Messiah, would enter Jerusalem as king in about 33 years. He knew the Messiah would be born in Bethlehem to a virgin. Why else would the angels be singing and the light be shining on this night? The overjoyed priest and the barely comprehending shepherds found the newborn baby with his parents in the mouth of a cave where a shed was attached to keep animals. There, the priest and shepherds began to praise God with lifted hands. <laughs> I see. 